Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate export connection on LinkedIn using Socinator. If you want to get the names of your contacts as well as their contact information out of LinkedIn, then Socinator can help you out. Let's start with the Accounts Manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right-click on your LinkedIn account and hit Go to Tools. It will take you to the Account Configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on LinkedIn using Socinator. Let's click Export Connection. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to export a number of contacts within a period of time while narrowing them down in the process. There are several configuration categories for Export Connection activity. Let's start with Connection Sources. We have three options. Number one is by software or connections you made using Socinator. The second one is outside software, so the connections you made yourself. Finally, we have custom users list. If you click it, you can enter the profile URL in this area of the LinkedIn connections you want to target. Let's say you have pasted the profile URL here. You may click this button to clear and it's gone. You may also click this button to import from CSV or text file Select the right file and click Open. When you're done, click the Save button over here. Next, we have Source Filter. Here you can specify how long you have been connected with your targeted LinkedIn contacts. So let's say connected within 3 days and 1 hour. The next category is Job Configuration. This allows us to choose the speed at which an account should export connections. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which you can use, like slow with an average daily activities of 25, medium with 125, fast with 208, or super fast with 333. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, click advanced settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each LinkedIn connection is exported. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes the software should pause after exporting the number of connections you set and number of connections to export per job. Number of connections to export per job will allow you to specify the number of LinkedIn accounts you want to export per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of connections to export per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another custom number of max connections to export per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to keep exporting connections even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on let's say Monday, click the trash bin button under Monday and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday for example, provide the start and end time, let's say 12 a.m. to 1.59 a.m. and click Add Interval, and it's added. Let's add another one on the same day, let's say 2 a.m. to 11.59 p.m., click Add Interval. So as you can see, we can have several schedules in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite, let's call it LinkedIn export click save you can then open it by clicking select favorite time and choosing linkedin export the next category is other configurations here you have other options that you want to specify depending on your preferences so check the first one if you want to export only the contact info next is if you want a custom html file name format so in this area, you can see the format of the file name. So open symbol, first name, close symbol, underscore, open symbol, middle name, close symbol, underscore, open symbol, last name, close symbol, underscore, open symbol, phone number, close symbol, underscore, open symbol, email address, close symbol, underscore, open symbol, profile URL, close symbol, underscore, Open symbol from account email, close symbol. So again, you may clear and import using these buttons. And when you're done, click save. Click the third one if you want to download in PDF format.
For the next one, you can specify how long to wait before each profile or connection has been exported. So let's say 10 to 12 minutes. Then finally, check this if you want to target recent connections only. The last tool is Manage Blacklisted Users. Blacklisted users are the LinkedIn accounts you do not want Socinator to interact with. In this case, Socinator will not export blacklisted users when this box is checked. So this can either be a private blacklist, which belongs to a specific LinkedIn account, or a group blacklist, which is shared between all the accounts you add. When you're satisfied with all the configurations and are ready to start exporting connections on LinkedIn, let's scroll up and click Save. Success. After saving, let's click the status button to make it active. Now that it's active, let me show you another option in automating export connection on LinkedIn through Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the social drop down button and select LinkedIn. It will take you to the accounts tab. Let's switch to the Grow Connection tab and select Export Connection on the left side of the app. Here, we can name our campaign. Let's call it LinkedIn Export Connection. Under Connection Sources, let's select by Software or by Socinator. For Source Filter, it's up to you. For Job Configuration, let's select Slow. For Other Configurations, let's check Only Contact Info, Download PDF and Recent Connections and let's skip blacklisted users. When you're ready, let's click the blue button, select account or accounts. In this part, you can select multiple LinkedIn accounts. Since we only have one account right now, let's go with that by checking the box and click save. After saving, let's click the red button, create campaign. If you want to proceed, click your account and the save button. This will automatically bring us to the campaigns tab where you can see that we have successfully created our LinkedIn export connection campaign. Click the status button to pause the campaign, and the action button over here will allow us to edit, duplicate, or delete the campaign. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot, and thank you so much for watching.